Hello scrappers and planet lovers, Tin Man here with another video. Today I want to talk about circuit boards, or classified as e-waste at a scrapyard. There are three different categories um, when you take this stuff into a scrapyard. Okay? E-waste circuit boards come from any appliance, they come in any shape and size, any color, and they are categorized into lower grade, medium grade, and higher grade and it does not depend on the grade does not depend on the size of the circuit board it depends on the metals and materials that are found on the circuit board so today what i want to do is i want to go through the different circuit boards um, starting with the lower grade and going up to the higher grade some of them some scrap yards will take it all in one lump uh, category they won't separate it um, so you need to find out from your scrapyard uh, what they like to do if you want to shop around uh, to see if other places do. I actually take off some of the materials off the circuit boards because the scrapyard I go to only take it as one price. And I'm going to show you how to do that today and, and what the good things or what things are worthwhile to take off to maximize your profit. So here we go. First circuit board that I'm going to look at is a circuit board this is lower grade this is actually from a tv and it's pretty heavy okay but again it's very low priced uh, when i take this in um, there are a couple goodies on here that i do take up do take off there's a nice aluminum heat sink right here okay so that's pure aluminum um, there is a transformer right here this transformer is actually pretty heavy because it's all steel with a little bit of copper underneath there is a separate category of transformers Okay, so you can take that off uh, or leave it on as weight. It depends uh, on you. Um, there are little spools of copper right there, a little bit of copper. Uh, I just take a little uh, plier and I actually just pop that off and I will take the copper out of there and put it in my copper bin. There are also a couple um, little silver contacts uh, in these plastic uh, bins here, okay? Uh, my dad doesn't take them off, he doesn't take the time to do that, he just puts it all in as, as one grade. Uh, I like to separate them and take them off, okay? But uh, again, as you can see, there's a lot of metal on here, okay? So they're going to look at that and, you know, they're not going to give me high price because that's where the weight is coming from, okay? So there is one lower grade. Um, here is another lower grade, okay? This also was uh, part of an, um, a stereo. Okay, and there are different colors. Some people say brown on green is always lower grade. Um, green on green could be mid grade. But again, it depends on your scrapyard and it depends on what's in here. This really doesn't have anything um, other than steel. Okay, so this is lower grade. Okay, a lot of wires. I do take the wires off and put them into my uh, wire bin because wire's worth more, but another lower grade board. Now this board, it's a small one off of a microwave. As you can see, there's a really nice spool of copper on here. Okay, and what I like to do is I actually cut it off uh, with a pair of pliers. Okay, and I actually take the copper because copper next to precious metals, it is the um, highest grade or highest paid scrap metal. Okay, and if I wanted to, I could have smashed this with a hammer, but I could also just unwrap it, which I'm doing right now. Okay, it takes a couple seconds, but I kind of find it therapeutic. Okay, and it just goes through this loop all the way. There's usually uh, two different uh, spools of it. Okay, and I just put this in actually uh, into my copper bin. Okay, and it's nice clean copper. Some of them will have a little bit of um, glue residue on it. If they do, then you just throw it into your number two copper. But this would be worth more as copper than it would be a lower grade board. Okay, so another lower grade board. Um, again, no gold on here, but there's a really nice um, copper spool. Another nice copper spool, okay. Not a lot, but it adds up, okay. Uh, some coated copper, this would be number two. A couple of aluminum heat sinks. Again, I take these off because aluminum is worth 50 cents a pound, and, and I think with lower grade, boards like this i'm getting something like three or four cents a pound okay and same with the cord i take the cord uh lower insulated uh, lower grade insulated wire goes for about 20 cents a pound um and 
I would find I get a lot more money separating these. Okay, this transformer, it's very thin. There's a lot of paper in there. I might just leave this one on for weight, okay? But again, there is a separate uh, bin for transformers. You will, can take them off and put them in there as well. Now, moving on to mid-grade boards. Mid-grade boards, um, again, there are a lot of different colors. This is green on green. The reason this is a mid-grade board is because there is all these little switches. This is, came off of a microwave uh, oven, I think. All these switches have a click. There are little pieces of silver in here. Okay, again, some people might say this is lower grade. Um, it depends on your scrapyard. Okay, you might get lucky. Uh, it's not very heavy anyway, so you're not getting much money. Okay, some people take the time taking out these silver contacts. Okay, um, these ones, there are bigger boxes. These plastic boxes all have silver contacts in them. And again, a lot of people don't know this. My dad actually just brings this in as is. Really nice transformer. Okay, I take the time of opening these up. And what I've done is I've already taken one of them. Okay, so here it is. I just pop the cap off. Okay, there's a nice spool of copper in there. I just, the copper just goes into my copper bin. But every one of these, you can see the tip, that's silver. Okay, so there are two, two on the other side, sorry about the camera, two on the other side. So there are four silver contacts in here with the copper. Um, if I looked at this gray board, there are four of these. Okay, obviously the bigger the box, the more copper, the more silver on um, the contact. Um, so I take this copper or a silver off, copper off, I take the silver off, I put them in separate bins and, and maybe one day I can make a, like a silver bouillon or something, but uh, I take these off. So this would be a mid-grade board. Okay, again, here's another one. The silver contact boxes come in all different sizes. Um, little transformer, okay. No gold, but again, silver. Okay, another one again, has different size boxes. Okay, a little transformer. Um, the brass prongs, I do take the brass prongs off here. This just came off of a cord. Okay, so there is brass right there, and this is brass as well. Okay, now the lower, last, best category is high grade board. Okay, high grade board has gold on it. Okay, now this is coming out of a computer. Notice on the top here that is a nice strip of gold. Now there's not a lot on there, but it is gold finished. All right, you can take these. I obviously I have to take the metal off, or they wouldn't give me the price for it. Um, what I actually like to do is. Because my scrap yard only gives me one price, I actually cut off this gold. All right, um, I gotta get my safety glasses on here just a second. Cause I don't want this stuff shooting in my eye. I will actually take this gold and I will separate it. I will put it in a little container uh, and uh, maybe one day I can uh, get a solution and melt it down, okay? And again, there's a little bit of board still that has gold, but it depends on your scrap yard, okay? This goes away, okay? And there's all different types. There's gold on the side here. This one as well has some gold, has a couple silver oscillators, okay? Um, other microchips. Uh, so this, these things as well, I think are oscillators. Um, these would go into my higher grade. Okay, another one. Uh, this is a, another type. This came actually off of a CD drive. Notice the gold prongs here. I would just actually, again, cut this off and take this, put this separate. Okay, and this would go into my, uh, there's nothing else on here, so my lower grade board. Okay. Now the last couple that I'm gonna show you are the nice ones, these ones, okay? So the first one, this came off of a flat screen TV. So I actually do have a uh, flat screen TV video that is coming up soon that I will show you this. This is a really nice gold tipped um, e-board or um, e-waste. Uh, these little things, flappy things also have a little bit of gold inside. So this would classify as higher grade board. 
Okay, it's not heavy, but again, it's because of the gold. Okay. Um, this computer chip is also higher grade board because it's got a really nice um, aluminum heat sink right here that has the plastic fan that I have to pop off. Okay, nice copper motor, but inside here, if I open this switch, there it is. And if you notice, this is gold. This is a gold chip. So I'm turning it on an angle on purpose. So all these prongs are gold. So this would be gold. There is gold in here as well because it fits into there like a puzzle. Okay, so there's gold in here as well. So you can take this in as is. Um, I actually take off the aluminum heat sinks. Um, these portals also had uh, chips in them with gold. Okay, these prongs have gold in them as well. Okay, so again, it's because of the gold that makes them a higher grade. Okay, and again, unfortunately, as we said, sometimes people say green on green. This is a red board. Okay, it also has right here a heat sink, and I'm gonna have to pop this off. There it is. Okay, so really nice weight on these heat sinks. Um, there's a lever. I'm hoping, there it is, pop up. This is again off a computer screen, different style, but it also has gold on it. So this board is higher grade. And there's also one other thing on here. Right here is a battery. Uh, the batteries, actually, if they say lithium on them, they are coated with silver. Okay, I take them off, put them into my batteries anyway, because I don't want any type of lead from the batteries going into the water system. Um, so, I like to take that off. Um, and as you can see, there were portals here, uh, depending on how much memory and depends on how much uh, the person is into computers, how many drives and memory sticks or whatever else it is they have. These would all have gold tips on them as well. Okay, and a couple of aluminum heat sinks. Um, so there you go, three different grades, low grade, medium grade, high grade. Uh, check with your scrapyard to see if they give you a different prices for all. Um, again, there are a lot of good stuff on these and we would not have appliances if we didn't have circuit boards. So a nice thing to take and, and find uh, with your scrapping. Um, hope this video was informative. If there's any questions or comments, please comment down below. Like, share, subscribe, and I will see you on the next video. Tin Man out.